hello guys this is Mohit uh, you can call me MB and this is my channel edit room and uh, today uh, I will uh, teach you how to uh, render in image sequence anything any uh, video clip or any your timeline work uh, so first of all I want to tell you just don't uh, uh, just ignore my bad English because I just want to teach you somehow so someone request me to don't don't uh, upload the videos with the description only uh, you should upload with voice so I am trying this is my first video just to give me review how is how is it so first of all uh, you have to you have to import some videos mm -hmm. yep. this is it okay this is my GTA uh, recording so I'm just uh, putting it on time timeline video only because we don't need uh, uh, audio for image sequence uh, I image sequence is, a, is also a video but it is a group of images uh, I will show you yeah. so we will take only small small part of this clip because it's too big 7 GB uh, clip so if you guys want this clip this is also too big we will take like the only this one so if we want this these clips this clip in image sequence render so just it's so easy and I would also tell you how to import image sequence as a video so first of all just double click it or if you have a big timeline just if if your timeline all there is there is all uh, all of your editing work and you start from here or anywhere you have to click here double click this will select how much work you done like if my last clip is here then I double click here it will select this I hope you understand so we will double click here and it will select it okay now uh, there is a rendering render as option click on the render as option and um, now there is an image sequence like uh, I just sh uh, click on show favorite only if uh, your default settings are like this and uh, in image sequence there is a lot of options okay most of the most most of uh, uh, use useful options are PNG and JPEG TIFF uh, some people also use TIFF file but PNG and JPG is a uh, good choice for if, if you just uh, you want to work good quality so TIFF is also a good quality but just let's try PNG so I just click on PNG project location desktop I will make a folder here you have to make a folder for a image sequence this is the uh, this is a, uh, a rule for image sequence render like image sequence okay okay so now this is my first pick name save and I will make it uh, in image sequence all the clips this all the frames uh, or th how many pixels uh, will become you can guess like guess by clicking let me check clicking here in the last frame go to the last frame and take 1109 photos it will make this clip uh, clip in images so we will render it png oh, let me show you in, as a default settings png default uh, image sequence the folder is in image sequence first is gta okay now save have window you will see image by image oh my god this is my this is a problem here change all colors I think uh, I don't change the settings uh, color settings so that's not pro not the real problem you just watch how to export in image so now we will check what it is look this is our folder image sequence and it make 1110 Pics you can see here. Okay. 
So, uh, what is what 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 its use? If someone ask me, what is benefit of image sequence? First benefit, the clear benefit is, uh, by by chance, uh, your project got hanged anywhere. Just suppose at this point for 90 frame number it hangs and lagged or crashed in video rendering you will lost your file it will not you have to start from uh, starting but in this image sequence you have to start from here then we all uh, we, we can attach all files in video just, just like I'm doing now just wait just see import click on import and uh, go to the image sequence folder just click on the first pick and here is a still open sequence just click check on open sequence and open it will ask you some information what you want to how 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 you want uh, uh, import it as a 25 frame or 59 frame you i just suggest you to take it as default because when you render you you checked it already so just take it default and ok and it will make only one pick only one uh, one pick but it is in clip ok now you understand what I am trying to say oh my god what the f here is the colors are different and here is again and set to nice things so guys this is the benefit of image this is the image sequence rendering tutorial so first benefit is rendering if your render lag, lag then you ha don't have to uh, start from the starting you can start from the rendering last you can check your last pick where is the last pick what is the last frame and you start from that frame this is the best benefit other benefit is uh, you know after effects also render in image sequences first then it made a video that's why the render is so heavy so we have i will suggest you mostly renders your motion graphics things or uh, uh, other mostly big effects things video clips in image sequence okay so thanks for watching and i know my english is not too good but i hope i am good to teach you what i am trying to teach so thank you so much